So in this video, we're going to look at another critical region method uh, prob uh, hypothesis test. Uh, the probability of a customer ordering a T is known to be 0.33. Out of 25 customers, 9 ordered a T. Conduct a hypothesis test at the 5% level to determine whether the probability of a customer ordering a T is greater than 0.33. OK, so let's go straight in with this. Let P be the probability of a customer ordering a T. OK? So the null hypothesis says that P has got to be 0.33. And the alternative would be that P is greater than 0.33. Because we're looking at whether it's greater than the, that probability. We assume that H0 is true, which sets up a binomial distribution with an N of 25 and a probability of 0.33. OK. Now we go to our tables. So menu, number 7, uh, binomial CD, and list. Now, uh, do we need to type in uh, all of uh, 0 to 25? Probably not. Uh, a third of the way is around about 8. So we probably need to just type in from 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. I'm going to go up to 20, OK, from 8 up to 20. Uh, N is 25. The probability is 0 0.33, OK? Now, if um, this is, uh, I'm not getting the values that I want, then I can always increase the number, OK, onto my list. So looking at my table that I've generated, OK, um, now, I'm looking from the top end, because we're looking at this greater than, and this 5% at the top end, so 0.95 overlap. OK? So I'm going to get 11, 12, and 13. I've got 0 0.9141, 0 0.9616, and 0.985. So the 5% overlap, the 0 0.95, is there. So. We don't want to write in the probability of x being greater than equal to 11 and 12. You always add 1 to those to find the overlap. So you look at 12 and 13. OK? If you did 11 and 12, greater than equal to 11 and 12, both of these would be greater than the significance level. You wouldn't have found your critical region. So greater than equal to 12 is 1 take away less than or equal to 11. So 1 take away that one. So we get 0 0.0859, which is greater than the significance level. And greater than or equal to 13 is 1 take away less than or equal to 12. So you get 0 0.0383, or 84 rather. Now that is less than 0 0.05. So the ones that are less are your critical region. So the critical region is 13 or more. So 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, uh, 20, because I can't count clearly, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. OK? They, that's your critical region, 13 or more. Now, nine customers ordered a T. Nine is not in the critical region. So we fail to reject H0. 9 is not a significant result. So there is insufficient evidence to suggest that the probability of a customer ordering a T is greater than 0 0.33. Okay? So that's how we can deal with this test.